Today's video guys, I'm in my ultimate settings of Room 6 Siege, my general settings, my no recall settings, how to make your game look like this. And also there's a sense bug right now, so I'm going to show you how to actually fix that. So make sure you guys like this video, share it to a friend. I wasn't going to give away 5 Black Eyes Control Freaks, all you got to do is comment Black Eyes below, a chance to win them. I picked the winners in 2-3 to three weeks, make sure you guys do sub as it will tell me who is subbed. And yeah, let's get into the video. Yeah, if you see my recall guys, I'll shoot to the sky, you can see it. It goes up, up to the right, so if you guys do want to pull down to the left, it'll be easier to control the recoil. See, if you see seen just then, the recoil goes to the right, so you guys want to be pulling down to the left. And I pull the recoil down to the left now, you can see the recoil pan is a lot better. You see it goes a little bit to the right and then pulling down left. With every gun you play, if you just shoot to the sky and see the pattern, and you just got to learn the pattern guys, obviously it's easier the more time you do play it. So for the general settings guys, we leave everything mainly to default, but... For the diffuser, we have both for drone after prep. We have um, semi-automatic, match play, replay turned on, with the crossplay on, and ping turned on. For the HUD settings, we have everything on normal. There's no point for yourself at a disadvantage. So make sure you guys put the HUD settings all to on. Some people have changed like, the points off, etc. But I think on, it just gives you the best. Best of the best. For the audio settings, they did change them this season. But night mode, 100% the best by a mile. Which guy have night mode? People do like hi fi, but I think the gun sounds way too loud. The night modes that massive volume 100 in game SX volume have down 100. Music off menu 100. Music off voice overload. This is like when they like the in game characters talk, but I got on 100. And the voice overload I have this on maximum. The HQ is on. The stereo output is on stereo, and then the headset. This is for me, but I think because I've Astros, I have like that. And then for the game chat audio for your teammates, I've got ninety one. For the space ends, I have VSync off, so people do it on off. I got off now, guys. And for the graphic settings, each guys I was on the left. If you're one twenty frames, if you're sixty frames, on um, that. And then for the FOV, I got eighty four with a hundred hundred display menu, and the brightness being sixty. The control settings on enabled, gadgets on advanced, so there's a drone and then lean in, we lean left and right, add on advanced. Controller output is default, you can change if you're on a B paddle, but I do use elite controller which does help. With the settings I play 24, 74, 5, 5. I've been playing the same sense roughly for the past couple of years, been changing a little bit. But if I'm on the 21, actually this should be 22. The gun with the 22 1.0 and then the rest being 26. It's a little bit slower compared to everyone else. But if you're perfect new to the game, I recommend these a lot. This does give you less recall, I think, using these settings. And I have all the advanced settings disabled and set to zero. Because that does play with your settings sometimes. And then I have I play the blue optical on 75. So for the graphic settings, you head to accessibility, over to color filter and click it and then make you guys put red and green. I kind of have red and green currently and I think the game looks a hundred times better. And you head to TV and display, which would be on general TV and display. Make sure you got the 120 frame setup and go to video overscan and put PC RGB turned on and then put the pixel rate to 36. Yeah, that's the currently best settings for graphics. Let's get into Elite Settings. Over to Elite Settings guys, I'm showing you my Elite Settings, I have this on slot 1. For the default settings, all on default, and then the right paddle as B, so guys crouch is easier. For the left stick, we have this on aggressive, and then on the third one, so 1, 2, 3. And then for the right stick, we have this on aggressive, and the first one. These are my Elite Settings, I've not changed these in years, so if you have changed them, these are my settings. I recommend you guys use these a lot. This does help with the recall. Everyone say, oh, you're Cronus, you're MNK. These are the Elite Sense guys. I recommend you guys picking up Elite Controller. Well, there's other controls on the market that do have these type of stuff. And yeah. yeah.